So, if you'll join me over here, we're going to start off tonight's show with the moment you've all been waiting for, and that's Sony's PMW F3 camera. Uh, here it is. It's about five and a half pounds. Incredible. Not the kind of thing you're going to put on your shoulder without, without a shoulder brace, but perfect for a tripod, perfect for a set of 15 millimeter rods, and a follow focus. Why do I say that? Well, clearly, the number one awesome feature about this camera is its 35 millimeter chip. It's a super 35 millimeter chip. It ships with Sony's F3 mount, all right? It's a new kind of mount, F3, but included in the box from Sony is a PL mount adapter. This is perfect for your Zeiss primes, your Arri primes, your Cook S4 primes. And what do I mean when I say it's perfect for those prime lenses? Well, you'll know that the Cook S4, uh, actually the, in the entire Cook I line of lenses and Arri's new line of prime lenses all have an uh, electronic interface. So the Cook lenses have the, a little electronic reader at the, at the 12 o'clock, and the Aries have a little electronic reader at the 3 o'clock. Well, the PL mount that ships in the box with Sony's PMW F3 cameras have both of those electronic sensors to read all the information off of your lenses. In fact, when you walk yourself through the menu system on the PMW F3, you'll be able to read the serial number, the f-stop, the, the, the location of the focus wheel, the location of the zoom wheel if it's not a, if it's not a prime lens. Some really sophisticated stuff going on. Um, and before we leave this super 35 millimeter sensor discussion, Verge, can you, can you bring up that, uh, that image of sensor sizes just for a quick discussion? It's, uh, it's really, it really lays it down for us really well. So here we are, super 35 millimeter sensor, 27.1 millimeter diagonal, right? It's a 23.6 by 13.3 millimeter sensor. This is the one all the way on the left for our internet viewers that can't see me indicating to the dot monitor here. So that is 24% larger than a micro four thirds chip. What is the benefit of, of such a large image? Shallower depth of field. Right? That's the holy grail, the shallow depth of field. You just want somebody, the front of someone's nose in focus, and everything else should be blown out. Cool. Well, walking down the line, 4 thirds is 24% larger. Then you see your familiar broadcast lenses. That's the 2 thirds inch camera. And finally, at the end, it's the half inch camera. All right, the half inch camera, that's what the rest of this EX line used to shoot with. So your PMW EX3s, your PMW EX1s, those are all the, the half inch chips. This is 24% um, larger than four-thirds, which is double, double. Uh, anyway, it's enormous. It's an enormous chip. It's going to help you achieve extremely filmic quality in your shots, uh, the likes of which you've never seen before.